sleep. That meal was incredible. I'm glad we chose this place for my birthday dinner. Although, I can't eat another bite. <laughs> and I don't want to risk eating any pudding. Mm-hmm. Yeah, not even ice cream. But thank you so much again for taking me here and treating me. <sighs> and I definitely need to remember to get some of that wine later. What's the name of it again? Yeah, I'm definitely getting a bottle later. I'll just get the waitress's attention so he can leave. Oh, you paid for it already? When did you do that? When I went to the bathroom. Oh, thanks so much, babe. Well, I guess we should head off then, since there looks to be a lot of people waiting for a table. Uh-oh. <laughs> uh. -oh. uh. <laughs> um, babe? <laughs> I'm so sorry. I was going to drive us back, but I didn't think... Uh, I really didn't think. I mean, I wouldn't have drunk alcohol if I remembered we brought my car. Would, do you mind driving? Ah, you're the best. <sighs> Guess that's why you didn't want to try my wine when I offered. I'm so stupid sometimes, I just don't think. I mean, if you had, I would have got us an Uber and just collected the car tomorrow. I feel bad getting you to drive. You mean it? You really don't mind? <laughs> you're gonna anyway since it's my birthday. Oh, you're just too good to me. I don't deserve you. Ah, that's... Oh my gosh. It's tipping it down. Oh, typical British bloody weather, isn't it? It was sunny when we left. Now it's dark and like the brink of the thunderstorm's about to go. We'll have to make a run for the car. I don't want to get my hair wet. I spent too long on this makeup. Okay. Ready? Go, go! Go! Ah! Oh, come on! Goodness, why am I so clumsy? The wine? Alright, smarty pants. Oh, but trust me to trip on a bloody pothole and- Ah! Ah! My ankle. Ah, yeah, I think I've done something to it. Ah! Bloody high heels and bloody pothole. And I'm sat on a dirty wet ground. Oh, my dress! I just had the claw clean too. I don't want to get it all mucky. Be careful. Ah, yeah, ah. It hurts when you touch it. Ah. Can I walk on it? I mean, I'll try. Can, can you hold my arm, please? Thank you. Three, two, one. Ah, no, 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 no. I, I can't. I can't stand on it. Ah. You might have to move the car over a bit to me and just... Ah! Or you could do that. You could have warned me before picking me up over your shoulder. Oh. No. I can't look. It's too embarrassing. People are going to stare. Relax and enjoy the princess treatment. I'll try to, but it's so embarrassing. I mean, what are people going to think? Like you're kidnapping me because I'm so beautiful. Pah, yeah, right. Don't say weird stuff like that or I'll get the wrong idea about you. <laughs> uh, yeah. <sighs> Guess I am going to be a passenger princess though, for sure. Do I want to go to the hospital? I'm going to say no. I know that's bad, but I don't want to spend my birthday waiting eight hours to be seen by a doctor. I know. I know. 
I know you're worried about me, but I promise I'll be careful. And if it doesn't feel better, I'll go tomorrow. Could you help me take off my shoes, please, though? These heels are bugging me. Thank you. You're so gentle. What did I do to deserve you? You've really made me feel amazing today. Thank you. I feel like a princess for sure, with you as my prince. I mean, the way you even got all dressed up for me too. You look hot in that suit. No, that's not the wine talking. I mean, I only had a couple of glasses. Wait, before you get moving. Did I tell you how much I love the smell of your aftershave? It drives me wild. Okay, yeah, okay, we should head back. So I'm starting to get cold. Let me just pop the heating on. How's my ankle? It still hurts, but mostly just when I move it. Don't know why, but I never get used to when you drive my car. No, 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 don't worry. I'm not going to be a backseat driver. I'm the passenger princess, remember? I mean it. And... It is kind of hot. I know you've driven me before in your car, but it's almost like... Um, how do I explain it? Like you're taking control for me. And I just love when you take control of me. I mean, for me. <laughs> What's that sly smile for? I am not blushing. It's just, it's just the lighting. I mean, it's not like I've never fully let you take control of my body before. Mm hmm <laughs> Do you mean we aren't going back yet? Then where are we go- Oh. That place. I guess then that all my talk of control got to you, hmm? We aren't a couple of teenagers anymore. Not that I think many people visit that place anymore for, um, that reason. Alright, alright. I'll be quiet for now. Lead the way. Since you're in control. Oh. It is empty here though. It's not another car in sight. I'm not complaining though. That's perfect for us. Since we aren't in view, I've been dying to take this dress off. Its wetness is uncomfortable my skin. Mm. It's difficult with the lack of room. And I, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, I just knocked my ankle on the door. Hmm? Uh. Huh. Ooh. Okay, then I suppose I'll let you take control then and remove it for me. You have to lean over. Your stare is so intense. Almost like you've never seen my bra before. <laughs> uh, I see. You like me still having my makeup on with the wet, messy hair from the rain. Come here. Mm. Huh? You can taste the wine on me, huh? Maybe you shouldn't taste my lips too much, though, since you're the designated driver now. I'm just kidding. I don't know if that's even a thing. <laughs> I should stop talking, hmm? <laughs> Are you giving your princess orders now? Okay. Okay. 
going straight for my collarbone with all those kisses now. Uh, my skin's all wet from the rain still, though. But you like that. Let me return the favour, then. I'll just carefully climb over to your seat, and it saves you leaning over awkwardly. Don't worry. I'll be careful with my ankle. Let me just climb and just... Ah, straddle you. There. Now I'm back in charge now, since I'm in the driver's seat of my car. Even if it is whilst I'm sat on your lap. <laughs> your hair is dripping wet. D Don't shake your head like that. I'm even more wet now. <sighs> Thank you for sharing your raindrops with me. Not. Guess I'll just have to punish you by going for your earlobes, since I know they're sensitive to you. Mm. Such a good, obedient prince. Now let me just... Mm. <laughs> Car windows have all fogged up. Even more privacy. And if we are, already alone. Hmm. Did I tell you already I love the smell of your aftershave? I have already. Well, it's just because it's doing things to me. And seeing you in your wet, dishevelled suit is just... Uh, God, that made me jump. Mm. I'll wipe the window down with just a small bit so they can't see me. It's hard with all the fog, but... Should act as a cover. We just. Oh shit. It's a police officer. Uh, yeah. Good, good idea. I'll, I'll roll it down just a tiny bit. Hello? Oh, um. Uh, no, sorry. I can't lower the window down or open the door, officer. I'm sorry. I, um. I got soaked in the rain and. Yeah, I'm just drying my dress out, so I'm currently indecent, but it's not- it's not for the reason you think, I promise. I, I, yes, I'm well aware I know what this spot is known for, but I, I assure you I am in the car alone. Shh. Don't say a word. Uh, oh, nothing, sorry, I am, um, I, uh... Oh, the handprint's on the window. <laughs> uh, you, you see, that was, um, me. It's not for the reason you think. There isn't anything like, uh... Well, yes, that going on. Yes, yes. I mean, we will leave... I mean, I'll, I will leave straight away in her time. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Oh, gosh. Don't laugh. That was humiliating. I better throw this dress back on and I guess we can continue the podcast. Thank you.